Times right now, I need you to pick up. Come on. Like, how you talking? Ugh. Like, what, what even made you just fight? Did she just told herself? Ugh. Girl, she in the shelter. She live in a shelter. They, no, it is a, it's a hotel. You know they do hotel shelter. That's still a shelter. Oh yeah. my god. Hello. No one is available. Please leave a message after the tone. Five seventeen Dog River Ranch Drive. Fuck, I just I just go myself. Fuck it. Boys, boys. I'm at the storage unit now. Yeah, just dropping off a few personal belongings, uh, nothing else. Yeah, I don't need any help or anything. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I think so someone's in the storage unit. Mm -hmm. Is somebody in there? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you a person? Mm -hmm. Yo, somebody come help! Somebody's in here! Fuck! Who? I, I don't fucking know! I, 
You guys should call the police. No, don't call the fucking police. Okay. Shit. All right, you good, fuck, man? You good? Let's get let's get the fuck out of here. Come fuck on. Fuck the man. Let's get the fuck I need to call. I need to call. Girl, oh, shit. Let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's so we can Come on. fuck these niggas. <laughs> You're welcome. I only help someone get out of storage unit, but you know. You feel better? Yeah, about that help. Uh, I might need some. Where is this fucking password? It's like you're having trouble logging in. You should yeah. probably put the password in. I'm trying to. What is that? It's a laptop. Everyone's so rude around here. I need to just ask some dumb questions. Well, there's nothing else to do around here. Go clean up something or cook something. Why, Michelle? Why are you still here? Aren't you supposed to be like out of the country somewhere? Yeah, well, my passport expired, so Dante said I can stay here. Gave me a key and everything. Figures. What? What was that supposed to mean? Oh, um, nothing. It's none of my business. What the fuck is this password? Fuck. So, why can't you get into this laptop? Oh. oh my gosh, do you stop with the questions? If you want to know, this guy that I was dating shot me. Well, I guess got me shot or whatever the case may be. Mm. And this is his laptop. And it might have some kind of like answers or something in it for me. I'm just trying to figure that out. What was his name? Fuck. His name is Andre. Andre? You know Andre's my middle name. Nor do I care. Okay, well. Maybe you should keep trying. Uh, don't you got somewhere else to be? Okay. Have fun. You enjoy yourself as well. The oh, fuck? Mm. Hey boss, you want to see me? Uh, Officer Scott, did you uh, apply for a promotion a few months ago? Yeah, I forgot about that. It was for uh, a relocation in a different jurisdiction. Yeah? <laughs> well, I have some good news for you. You got the job. The lieutenant position is open. It's yours. Wow, wow. I'm lost for words. I can't believe it. Well, I'm more than ready, ready to take this challenge and take this job and, you know, just go to the next level. Well, I'm glad that you're excited. Um, the lieutenant position in, in uh, Cleveland, Ohio. It's a bit different than D.C. It's um, not as, you know, how can I put it, uh, fun. It's in the Midwest, and uh, but uh, it's yours if you want it, and uh, I couldn't be prouder of you. Wow, Chief. I'm honored, but I was thinking more like a different jurisdiction, like, you know, Annapolis or Potomac, you know, even Baltimore, but Cleveland, Ohio? Ugh. Trust me, I know. Cleveland, Ohio, it ain't D.C. and it ain't Atlanta. And I know if you uh, had your pick, I know it would be a different jurisdiction, but I think this is a great opportunity for you. Chief, do you mind if I take a little time to think about it? I mean, I got a lot of things going on here. I'm not quite sure if I can, you know, leave right now. Listen, I know you have a lot of questions, you're not very sure, you know. But I tell you what, I'll give you two weeks. Fourteen days tops, but I need an answer. Roger that. That's that's perfect. Thank you, Chief. Hey, hey, hey. You hear the door? You hungry? That's our food. You ready for your chicken tenders? Yeah. You want to give him the money? Oh. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I've been waiting and praying that y'all came home. Yes. Oh, my God. But, hold up. Where's my sister? 
Listen, y'all missing one, right? Tasha, I don't know. I don't know. Hold up. What do you mean you don't know? Coy, you said that he said he knew where the fuck my sister was. That's not exactly what I said. See, Coy, you fucking playing with me. I'm not playing with you're you. You're playing with me, Coy. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Stop fucking what playing with me. Lakeisha, Lakeisha, come get this baby. Look, I don't know why you're taking the baby away. Don't change shit that I said. I'm reclaiming my time. I never said I knew where she was. I'm reclaiming my time. It's too much going on. Well, you need to start explaining what's going on, man. Okay. Thing is, I found Naomi, but we got separated. Some guy kidnapped us. He took her, someone else took me. Okay, so where did he take you? He dragged me into a storage unit. Oh, hell no. That's some white people yeah, shit. I'm just glad I found your location when I did. Thanks, Corey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cute. But where the fuck is my sister? Find her location. I just don't know. See? This is that fucking bullshit. My fucking sister could be dead right now. I'm not trying to have my sister out here like all these she other transgender women dead. coming up fucking dead. But she's not How dead. you know? Because the guy that kidnapped us, I heard him, he said something about a plan and making a lot of money off of her. We gotta come up with a plan. No, we don't have to come up with shit. What? If he said that he's gonna make money off my sister, we don't need to make a plan. He's gonna find us. And you just broke out of his hiding spot. So I'm sure they're gonna come looking for you. We just need to chill. What? Marjorie, what? I, I don't, I think she might be right. I don't know about this boy, honestly. I, mean, I just don't. kind of making sense. Though. How is she making sense? What y'all keep a secret from that? No, we're not keeping secrets from you. But I feel if you want to go in this direction, we are going to need protection. These dudes are crazy. Oh, okay. I got crazy. I got protection. What are you? Here go your protection right here. That's all you need. You go back to work, act like nothing ever happened, and if somebody play with you, there go your protection. You too, Coy. Take it. I think she wanted me to take the gun. Take the gun. We gotta act like it's a regular day in the neighborhood for these niggas. They'll find us, and when they find us, we got something for their ass. All right? I'm all right. You all right? I'm a lawyer, like, well, how am I supposed okay. to around? Okay, so you can get yourself out of the mess that we're going to create, okay? Now you can go. I'll take you home, Michael. Goodbye. Ta Tasha. Lock my door, please. Thank you. They are gonna get us killed. I need to find my phone. Xavier. 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 What do you want? Can I talk to you? Trying to get your dick sucked again? My nigga, it's not even like that. Man, please. My pops, though, of all people? My nigga, it's not even like that. So you were or weren't getting your dick sucked by my father? Thought so. Xavier, please, let me just explain. Hurry the fuck up and explain what you gotta say. Come on. All right, so basically what happened was, you know, he hit me up on Jack, mm -hmm. and I didn't even know that was your pops. So what you're saying is, my father, Mr. Homophobic himself, hit you up on a gay app? I find that hard to fucking believe, man. It's called DL, down low. I mean, he hit me up three o'clock in the morning. I got text messages and everything that I could show you. Like, I'm from Bronx, New York. We don't lie about shit like that, you feel me? Like, I wouldn't necessarily lie to you about your father hitting me up, you feel me? Oh, so you so big and bad. Run me the receipts. Let me see. <laughs> well, let me show you this a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So this is the time that he hit me up. That's the booty. Oh yeah, your father is a bottom. I just wanted to let you know. You see that there? Xavier. What do? Are you okay? Security. Uh, 
911? Nah, I know I told you to get the double stuff, but goddamn, I didn't say vanilla. Well, that's the only one I'm saying. You ain't go down the um, actual aisle that had double stuff. Isaiah, it's an Oreo. They all in the same spots. I know it's your well, first time going grocery shopping. on that shop. side, bitch. <laughs> I ain't gonna beat you much, 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 Ice cream? You got a lot of mouths to feed. You got a lot of snacks in this bitch. You know, I just got my food stamps recertified, baby. Oh yeah, you always got somebody moving out. Excuse me, bitch. Was that was that shade to me? Like you know, listen, I'm trying to save a marriage, okay? Listen, if 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 my motherfucking sister say, can she, I let this motherfucking crazy ass husband of hers stay at the place? I'm gonna let the crazy ass husband stay at the motherfucking place, bitch. Oh, so you saving a marriage? Last time I checked, you was trying to save a hoe or save that nut. Do we need this? This bitch tried it. Excuse me. Hello. He hello. What you not gonna do? Keep on fucking trying me. <laughs> now listen, I'll keep it real. He did come up on me the other, like last week or so, at my job. Mm hmm. We kind of made out. Kind? What? Accidentally. On purpose? Kind of accidentally on purpose? I don't fucking know. But on honesty, you know. Eva did ask for him to stay, and after all, I'm trying to save a marriage. Now let me get that, cause Halloween is coming up, and I need for you to go back to the cereal aisle and get a family size. We're saving the family, a family size. And child, you about to break that family up? <laughs> okay. Thanks. Can you get um some pizza stuff too? Can we make a pizza? Family size. Piece of stuff, you know. Family size. Let's make a piece for the family. Fam family size. Gotcha. Fancy seeing you here again. Hi, Cliff. Hey, how are oh, you? I'm good and yourself. Good. So, I'm actually kind of glad I ran into you mm. again in here. Whoa, surprisingly it's not on the cereal aisle. Right. <laughs> I kind of want to apologize for the whole fiasco at my house the other day. Uh, that, hmm. With the baby and the girlfriend and the ex-lover. I told you all of that? Oh, yeah, you were really drunk. Yeah, about that. I'm sorry. But I will say I want to make it up to you. Make so, it up as in what? Well, I do owe you a gym session, so. This is true, because the last one didn't happen at all. Yeah. <laughs> well, I promise you I'll show up sober this time. And 100, you have my 100% undivided attention. <sighs> Let me see, let me see. 100% but I promise you sure I promise um well I don't know how my schedule is looking at the moment but I will definitely text you and let you know okay well the training starts now so get rid of these <gasps> and you're gonna get these I'll take these what is that I'll take these, what, what is these? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like this. Don't run. I'm going to get you.
bitch. Well, if it's not the presidents of triflingbabydaddies.com, what you want? Is Carla here? Really? What you want? Come on, let me speak to Carla, please. Come in. Wait. Where you park at? In the front. Oh, okay. Don't move the car. They might tell you shit. Because you know the trash bag come at six and we sure don't want to miss it. us and I'm sorry about that but and I wasn't ready for a baby so, but I want to be a part of my so I, I don't understand like why you can't because I want to be a part of my child's life the one you want to part I know I know but I'm here to make amends for what because I don't want my child growing up fatherless So, you don't want your child to vote father, it's the child that you didn't want. Anyway. <laughs> I'm just really starting to feel like, some type of game with you. <laughs> You know I'm not trying to hurt you, but... Come on, baby. I'm here now. I do not trust you. I mean, you just feel like I'm a whore like, on the streets. You don't understand. But I'm here now. I'm here now. I just want my child to have both of their parents in this life. Or her life. I don't know. I already know. Ohio. Yeah, that's what he said. Man. So what are you gonna do? Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Well, you did want to transfer. Yeah, but in a different jurisdiction. I was thinking like Potomac or Baltimore, but fuck, Ohio? <sighs> but you know, it might be good for you though. New area, new start. Yeah, but my whole life is here. Carla, the baby. I can't leave them. Yeah, that's right. How did that go? Did you talk to her? Yeah, we talked. Everything's good, but if I leave now, I just think it'd be bad for the baby. I won't be around. Well, you know what you gotta do. And what's that? Stay here. Man, you make it sound so easy. But yo, this pay raise though, I don't know if I can turn it down. I hear you, man. A pay increase is always nice, but it can't be that much. You're leaving your child behind. Dude, what's up? Check it out for yourself. Oh, oh. 
guess child support can't be that bad. <laughs> what the hell am I gonna do? Yeah, bro. I might have to take this for you if you don't take it. <laughs> Yo. Eli, what's going on? Man? Hey, what's up? How you doing? Good, good. Yeah. Last time I saw you, uh, you uh, was taken yeah, to the yeah, site yeah. ward and... Come on now, really? I mean, really? you was Look, a little crazy ran there. all the tests or whatever, everything came back good. So. Good. Better man. Good, good. So. I just wanted to say thank you. Right. Um, and to apologize for what happened the other day. Um, yeah, you know, wasn't wrapped too tight. So, um, yeah, but I did take your advice, took the extra credit class, and your boy is proud How are you graduating? Good. So, Good. have you spoke to your father? Yeah, no, that's a different story. Um, I've turned over a whole new leaf, and I'm definitely moving forward with just growing to the strongest man I can be. Good. So, if he wants to reach out, he can. Other than that, right. Fuck it up. Uh, deuces. So. Right. But I do want you to check your email. Right. Um, I put a nice little thank you in there. So Aww. ticket to graduation. So about to go to grad. My boy about to my boy about to my boy about to my boy about to fuck it up, fuck it up. May I have your attention please? You know. But no, thanks, Bob. Alright, cool. Uh, see you at graduation. Alright, cool, cool. I'm just saying, I I don't understand why I need to be at the club. Because you have created? I mean, Tina created Beyonce, but that bitch not at every Formation concert now, is she? Look, if you come, it'll attract more people. Think about the publicity. Publicity? But boy, by how? 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 What do you mean, how? How? Tell me how that's good. Tell me how me coming. It's good for publicity. Um, you're the COO of one of the biggest labels in the industry? That's no dumbass. How? What, what do you mean? Well, I didn't ask you for my credentials, you know, my resume. It is long. And she slays, right? Mm, I guess. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. But, I'm not, I'm not a celebrity, so I don't know how I... I don't know how me and my little 13K Instagram followers is gonna affect your event. Oh, 13K, huh? So you are kind of like a little celebrity. So this is perfect. And if you're not one, then um, you about to become one. Mm-mm, no. Listen, I, okay. I don't think we seen each other. We, we not here. We used to be here, but I don't think we here. See, I. I don't, I don't have time for all of that. I don't. Like, you know, the more you become big and famous and all that stupid shit, the more the IRS, they know about your shit. Like, you know how much money I got? Do you know how I really paid for this shit? You'll never know because why? I ain't nobody and I like to keep it that way. Okay? So, that night, I would love to come, but I'm gonna be in bed. And you're more than welcome to join if you like. Look. Just think about it. You're graduating in a couple of weeks. You're gonna have more time on your hands. And it's time for you to focus on your brand. So you're telling me becoming more of a socialite is good for my brand? Hell yeah! Look at Kim Kardashian, brand big as fuck. Ain't done nothing. Well, that's true. You know, and those ETV checks are a little cute coin. All right. I'ma think about it. I ain't saying yes, I ain't saying no, but I'ma think about it. I'll save the date in my phone and I'll I'll see if I can, you know, step through. Where is my phone? I don't know. Look in your room. I'll be damn. I left that bitch on the toilet. Mm-hmm. I'll be back. Yeah, I'll be back. Who the fuck you booting, little boy? Make sure you cut that fan over there. I'm trying to smell that shit.
Hello. How you doing? Good. How you get here? I have a key. How'd you? Oh, no. You're the guy that my wife slept with. I don't recall that, but yeah, that's what she said. Hmm. Surprised you're still here. Well, what do you mean? Of course I'm still here. Because your wife said something don't mean I'm just finna go. <laughs> nah, bruh. Well, I don't know. It just seems like Dante moved on. It seems like a guy comes here like every night and... I don't know. It just seems like he's over you, but... If you love him, he loves you. What do you mean somebody here every night? Dante! Hold on. Man, get out here. Give me a second. Hurry up. Yes. Hurry up. Damn. Hurry up. But you rush me before I said I think about it. Give me a week. So you've been hoeing? What are you talking about? Ooh. Have you been hoeing? What are you talking about? So you're going to sit there and really act like you don't know what I'm talking about. Because I don't. You know what? Be quiet. I'm not, I, I can't do this with you. I cannot. Do what? We were just talking about the event. Oh my God. Mm, that was awkward. What happened with that? Do you think I know? You seem mad about something. Why do you care? Um, listen, I don't even know the. F well, look, three's a crowd. Drink. I'm glad he's gone. I don't trust him anyways. You don't trust him. And do we really have a reason to trust you? Well, let me show you something. Hold up. This computer right here. Isaiah's been trying to hack into this computer for the last two weeks, and you're logged on to it. Well, he told me the guy's name was Andre, so I typed in Andre, and it came right through. You know black people aren't good with those security names. <laughs> so, and that's where I found. Move. Move! Damn it! Shit, let me breathe. Mm -hmm. You Photoshop that. Nope, it's right there. I don't have time for this. I don't, I don't have time for this. Oh, Lord. You need a cuddle, buddy? But anyway, I just, I feel like I'm losing my, my mind, like. <sighs> I mean, what is it now? If it's not one thing, it's another with you. <laughs> I'm gonna act like you're not trying to play me. Because you know what? I was locked up in a cage. A cage, like a fucking dog. You do not have any idea of what I've been through. I have every right to say what I'm trying to say to you. You're supposed to be my friend. And now I feel like I lost my sanity. I lost my client. Let me talk. So, what's, what's the problem, Michael? <sighs> well, thing is, I had a nightmare. I haven't had a nightmare like this in I don't know how long, but it was of the guy who kidnapped us. Me and Naomi and... I got murdered. Like it felt so fucking real. Like, like I don't know what to do. I feel uncomfortable going home. I don't want to go. Like, I'm just coming to you as a friend because I really, really need your support right now. I need your assurance, man. I don't have anybody. I don't have anybody. I don't know what I'm going to tell her sister. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do. Listen, listen. Everything's gonna be okay, okay? Everything's gonna be okay. Whoever has her, they need something, so they're gonna have to come back to you or your sister to get it. And with that alone, I have faith that everything's gonna be okay, okay? It's gonna be okay. Don't worry about it. I promise.
Y'all are so big compared to my head. Extend it. It's not that big. That's like two of my arms. It is not. I promise you. Yeah. Oh, you know, I'm gonna like just went. Oh, oh. So I gotta move this though. It you gotta move this though. I gotta close one day. Eyes work, you gotta go to sleep. Are you growling? <laughs> <laughs> You ready? It's not that I'm picky Trying to get me turned on It's quite tricky But if you can't make it C-O-M-E-M-I-M-I-N-G Then I'm out the door Song and you're not the first thing I think about. Ain't got me. If you ain't got me coming in my mind. You ain't got oh, me. Ooh, I love to grip a sweat soaked body next to me. I love the rhythm of another heart. Man. So, what do you think <laughs> of the workout? Just enough. Oh, I'm gonna be so so at work tomorrow. That's a good thing. That means you know you had a good workout. Maybe it wasn't a workout. Or maybe it was the instructor. Well, if it was that good, maybe I'll charge you next time. Well, you can't charge for something you enjoy doing. Maybe it wasn't just the workout I enjoy. I enjoyed you. <sighs> so you enjoy me now. Yeah, I do. Well, I enjoy you too. And you gonna call this bitch and tell her what I want. Why do I have to put my sister in it? Bitch, just fucking call her. Hurry the fuck up. Hello? Tasha. This thing on me. 